What kind of foundation cracks are bad? I love this question and I'll tell you why. It can be a really complicated and confusing discussion. But you didn't come here to be confused, you came here to get answers and I'm going to give you one. Hey, how about this? Let's use a multiple choice question. Here we go. Which cracks in your foundation wall are the worst? Vertical cracks? Horizontal cracks? Diagonal cracks? Stair step cracks? Long cracks? Variable width cracks? All right, now give me five seconds of Jeopardy music. So what do you think? Well, it's a bit of a trick question because the answer is none of the above. And I'll tell you why. The worst crack you can have in a foundation wall is an active crack. And that means a crack that is growing. Active cracks are very bad. So if you want to know if a crack in your basement is growing, there are a couple of different things that can be measured. First, mark on the wall or use a piece of tape to mark the end of the crack. If the crack is growing, then eventually you'll find that whatever you put on the wall is no longer at the end of the crack. The other thing you can do is measure the width of the crack at a consistent location. Be sure to mark the wall to remind you where you're taking your measurements so it's always in the same place. You'll either need a pair of calipers to measure it or another option would be to use something called a crack monitor. And that sounds like a high tech term, but a crack monitor is really just like having a fancy piece of measuring tape mounted to your wall. Now an active crack will have the most movement during significant weather events like long periods of drought or after a heavy rainfall. Keep in mind that we're talking about slow movements, so keep checking it over a period of weeks, months, or years. You will not be able to see this movement in real time with your naked eye. Actually, let's make that the pro tip of the day. I would hope you cannot see the crack growing in real time with the naked eye. Because if you can, you are standing in a very bad place and you better hustle to find somewhere else to be. Okay, one final thing. Even though active cracks are the worst, Really, depending on the circumstances, all of the other answers to my multiple choice question can also be considered to be bad cracks, which makes it important to have them looked at by a reputable foundation repair company. Look for a link below if you need help finding one in your area. And while you're down there, smash the like button. Don't be afraid to subscribe or drop a comment or ask a question. We'll take it all. So thanks for being here. I'm Kyle. This is Ask an Engineer, and I'll see you next time.